Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our snowy wonderland. Now, today was a better day than yesterday. Um, if you follow us on any of our social media pages, well, I don't think I post anything to Instagram, but if you follow us on Instagram as well, you know we had baby goats around Thanksgiving. And for about the last six weeks, Abby's been bottle feeding her little baby, Jordan. We had something tragic happen um, that we discovered yesterday morning. Little Jordan, as, he, as the snow fell, he fell asleep and the pigs laid on him and crushed him and killed him. And it's been a really hard, it was a really, really hard day yesterday. And Abby, I've never seen her in such hysterics and she just cried all day. And, um, today we figured we'd go out, do a little, since the roads are clear, do a little, um, road trip up to Lancaster County. And we went up to a little mill up there where they sell animals. And, um, we got Abby two new little babies to take care of to kind of help her loss her mourning a little bit. Uh, she got two little... These are Abby's bunnies right here. Those are her babies, too. We got her two little um, miniature chickens, old English chickens. A little rooster and hen. And she's really, really, she really, really likes them. And they're really cute. And I love his little crow. He's got a really high-pitched little squeak. It sounds like a squeak. It doesn't sound like yeah, a... I can get the crow. <coughs> can you? I don't know. Is that going to work, Bobby? I don't know. But they're really cute. <coughs> you can hear how high-pitched this clock is. We don't usually have small breeds. We've had a couple in the past, but... Like all ducks. It, yeah, Bobby has little miniature ducks, but not chickens. They're super cute. And I also want to show you guys the pe new peacock we got. Bobby's birthday's um, this coming weekend, so we've been wanting a peacock, so we got a little juvenile. The big ones are more than twice as expensive as the juvenile, so we went ahead and got a juvenile peacock. He's got three pea hens because we lost our male this last summer to a predator attack. So we got a new bow for the ladies. And he's about the same age as our two little pea hens that hatched this spring. So these are, this is our peacock house. We converted our um, corn crib into a peacock house. A pea fell house. But there's the new guy. Our females are black shoulders. They're uh, Indian breed, a uh, blue Indian breed. I don't know what he is. I'm not real knowledgeable with peacocks. If you guys know what breed he is, let us know in the comments. Please. But they all seem to be getting along okay. <clears throat> he won't be ready to He's breed till friendly. next spring though. Well, not we this spring. Maybe, maybe. Well, if you follow how it typically happens, the males have to be two before they start They might breeding. mature quicker. So he's only know. a year old. And then we got a few more chuckers as well. Because we want to start breeding them. Oh yeah, dog. oh yeah, Bobby got a new Muscovy. Killer dog. He calls him killer. He's he's aggressive. But he felt killer. sorry for him. He, he said, I saw a fire him and I had to get him. I said, yeah, hell's fire in him. That's what's in him. <laughs> but he's up in the pasture. He's actually getting along with everyone. I'll show you our, I'll show you our chuckers. Yeah, and he's really aggressive. He probably would kill a fox. Like, he is aggressive. He, he's a very, he's got a very strong he's personality. He's huge. He's big, but I don't know if he's as big as a fox. Well, he probably could fight himself pretty good. Fight, stick up for himself. But here's the chuckers. We got more. Hopefully, they start laying in the spring and we can start breeding, hatching them. 
So I wanted to show you how beautiful the snow is. I wanted to let you all know about Abby's little baby bottle goat. If if you want to help out our cause, we're we're trying to make our farm safer for our animals, and we're raising money on Facebook under Faithful Friends Farm. We have a fundraiser going on right now uh, to raise money so we could build a new pasture so we could separate the pigs from the goats and be a little more organized. We just haven't had the funds this year and with the help of with the help of all of you we're we're gaining the funds to be able to do that. So but you see how beautiful the snow is. And we thank you for anything you can contribute. Thank you for your prayers for Abby. She needs them right now. And these guys don't mind the snow, do ya? They're waiting for doggy food. I have to feed them. Are you hungry? You want me to get you your food? So, I want to say my goodbyes. Thank you for watching. And we'll see you next week. And unless we have a video before then, but I doubt it. And God bless.